although the year is early, we think that this one, I think that this one is going to stick around in the top of the hit parades in terms of boring fights, heavyweight fights of the year. The floor is open. I think I've been on record on your show on numerous occasions saying Joseph Parker has zero dog. Yeah. He managed to find an opponent with possibly less. <laughs> it, it's hard. It's hard to see how this was anything other than a sparring match. Yeah. And not a very entertaining one either. No, no, no. There we see Joseph covering up. Has he got tassels? Has he got the audacity? Does Joseph Parker have the audacity to be wearing tassels indicating excitement on <laughs> his shorts? Indicating excitement. <laughs> Iron Kong. Has Joseph Parker got the audacity, the bare face nerve, the temerity to be sporting tassels? Silver, no less. Silver tassels. <laughs> on his short, which is normally indicative of a excitement about to yeah. go down. Yeah, you know, he's saying like he's gonna bounce around and the tassels are gonna be flying and all that, man. Let me tell you something. <laughs> Let me tell you something. I think, he's got tassels. I think he's Joseph. Got tassels. Damn, there's tassels there. Look, they're moving around. Oh, Iron Lord. Kong, please. Joseph, Joseph, in my opinion, I think Joseph Parker has stagnated in his career. Like he looks like he's going backwards. Like huh. since 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 when he fought Ruiz and he looked you know really fast and he looked really promising. He beat well, I think Ruiz, but he beat Ruiz on the cards, and he came in to fight AJ and all that. But you could see even in the Huey Fury fight, mm. he kind of like, like got bogged down, and yeah. it's like I, I think as John Dean said, he doesn't really have that vibe in him to go for the kill. You know what I'm saying? Mm. He don't really have that sort of vicious streak in him. Like, mm -hmm. if he's not able to bully the fight, yeah, he can't force the fight. He can't impose his will. If the opponent doesn't wilt, he won't impose his will. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So I, I don't know if it's his, you know, I think it's his trainer. I don't think he, his, his team has done Kevin him any Barry. justice. Kevin Barry. Yeah, I don't think Kevin Barry just, just is focused on keeping his hair slick or moist or <laughs> whatever. Is it is it actual, actually Rafi? Yeah. I've got I've got a question for you. Is Barry the wearer of a toupee? I don't know what that is, bro. <laughs> What's going on with that hair? It's so bad. <laughs> I just think the only plausible explanation is that it's a very cheap toupee that he's got on top of his head. It's terrible. Look terrible, Barry, man. Barry, I think, is one of the finest exponents of the uh the, the 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 head furniture, uh, the, the <laughs> finest exponent of head furniture. He likes to move it around. He likes to give it a little shake. He likes to jump in the pool and forget to just adjust it. You know, I think uh, he's he's a national treasure. The whole the whole build up to this fight just seemed so low rent, so low budget. Yeah. I mean. If you watch the Wayans, it looked like it was it was shot with like a like a two megapixel <laughs> camera. Just just terrible. It just that, seemed that, like that, that's Dave just Higgins like all over. David Higgins, he, exactly. It was just Higgins. <laughs> do, do you remember David Higgins is um kind the, the great reveal, the great reveal. When he was going to expose AJ, is that yeah, what yeah, 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 yeah. That was the a absolute shadiest piece that of was, that was one big <laughs> <laughs> But what, what, what about the sort of flip chart thing they had in the background? Oh, <laughs> the whole God. thing yeah, took like, amateur to new levels. It was like a geography class. I thought my old geography <laughs> teacher was going to come out. <laughs> oh, but Rafi, real yeah. talk, Joseph mm. Parker has to get away, either get away from Kevin Barry. Yeah, or bring somebody else to New Zealand, but yeah, I think he's gone as far as he could go with Kevin Barry. The guy uh -huh. looks like he's going backwards. Yeah, uh, on a more fundamental point, Iron Kong, I actually don't think he's got anything to do with his trainer. Uh -oh. I I think he's lacking that fundamental. There's just no dog in him. He's got nice skills. He can move nicely. Yeah. His physical dimensions are not 
that great for a heavyweight. His power's average. His chin's decent. Mm. But when it comes to it, he just can't push the envelope. He's a bit like Huey Fury. <laughs> That's a good comparison. It's, it's, seriously, these guys, they've got some okay skills. They've got decent chins. Mm. But when it comes to finishing a fight, when it comes to finding a way to win, they're just yeah. found wanting. Clinch, bunch, bunch, out. They all think she's going to But the other thing is, if, if he'd have fought Andrew Ruiz outside of New Zealand, if he'd have fought to come outside New Zealand, very questionable if he'd have got those results. Very questionable. Very, 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 very questionable. Very, very questionable. Um, and so, you know, it's it's a nip and tuck thing with Joseph Parker. And now people are, people are in uproar with his last fight with uh, Junior Fire. Uh, his fight with Junior Fire and, you know, the, 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 the scores had very wide margins again. You've seen a few incidents of that. And uh, it was really nip and tuck. It was a, it was a close fight. Some people, some people had it going for far. Uh, I've seen people calling it for far. Mm. I mean, far's performance was horrible. Yeah. And let's be honest, he's fighting the biggest A-side in the history of New Zealand boxing. Mm. How does he think that a jab and clinch game plan is going to rest away yeah. the decision from Joseph Parker on a Dave Higgins card? Highly improbable. Iron Kong. It was improbable that uh, that tactics just was going to be uh, sufficient. As you said, some places he might have got that win. And he didn't deserve win. that win. Even win. his even his trainer Eugene, mm, Eugene. like when when he when, when he was talking about how he exposed Parker, Eugene was like, "What?" You, you could see his face, like, "Bro, just shut up." Joseph Parker and Junior Far, and uh, they were very, 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 very underwhelming Joseph Parker mate do you mind if I punch you <laughs> now mate go ahead do you mind if I punch you back no not at all not at all not at all so the Rafi's happy hour joined by John Dealey and Iron Kong